and welcome back to Multiplayer Set Factory with Bentham. Hello. Uh, this is Spaghetti Junction. It is a mess. You also mm -hmm. put your torch on. Oh, I have. Yep. Because it, it was nighttime while we were exploring. We're back at base. And uh, now we can ah. actually use the, the new stuff in the, the new update. Oh, God. The belts. The belts. And the key thing is that... For, for this particular part of the factory, is we now have vertical conveyors. Oh, and also, we've just unlocked the first hard drive thing. Do you want to go do oh. that? Yep, I'm going to go. I'm going to go. <laughs> Ow. And then just chuck the next one in there straight away. We're just going to be burning through them for a while. Actually, I need to clear out half the stuff I have on me and just put it in the storage chest there because I've got, like, slugs and stuff. By the way, it seems like all food is regenerated now that we're in uh, the experimental version. Yeah, I noticed that. Oh, so, right, so we get... It's alternate really status, good. alternate modular frames, or alternate encased industrial beams. Uh, I don't know about any of those. Let me consult. So, the alternate modular frame is six reinforced iron plates and six steel pipes makes three frames. Industrial I'm just beam. opening the alternate recipes thing. So what have we got? beam is 18 steel pipes, 10 concrete to make three beam. Just tell me the things. We got encased industrial beams. Was it uh, modular, modular frames? Frame and stator. Stators. Uh, we're making all those already, right? Yes. Of, of course. Um, the stator one looks pretty good, though, because it's just catarium wire and steel pipe. Okay, you think we could, like, just get... We could go get... Caterium sorted. Actually, yeah, we can get ridiculous amounts of Caterium. What, like the near by deposits, I think, are all pure, and you can get insane amounts of Caterium from them. So it probably makes sense to just. That said, we are just making it from wire and steel pipes. Hmm. But I feel that we will actually be drowning in quick wire in a couple episodes' time. At least that's my plan. That said, we are drowning in wire anyway. Yeah, but like. It means that we can always turn the copper to another purpose. Now, let me There's also the encased industrial ones. beam, a modular frame there. Um, it wouldn't be a terrible idea to hook in the steel pipeline to making the modular frames instead of the iron rods. Like, are we using the steel pipes for anything else right now? Oh, we're using them for stators. The rods are making screws and the screws are making the plates, which we need. Well, the moment we have rods going into modular frames, we could cut that line and put in steel pipes. Yeah, but we still need the rods to make screws. Yeah, but it's it's one of the requirements gone. Okay. I feel like we could go for any of these, honestly. They're all pretty good, looking at the the thing. And also, it's all stuff you've been working on, so it's it's your choice of, like, what do you uh, want to rehook up the belts to? Um, true. What is the difference between the encased industrial beam and the normal encased industrial beam? Um, normally it is uh, one steel beam and one concrete, I think. This doesn't actually display it well. I think it's a single steel beam and a single concrete, but that doesn't seem right. That doesn't seem right. Oh, it's four steel beams and five concrete to make presumably one industrial beam. The alternative is 18 steel pipe and 10 concrete to make three. That seems better. But how many... Uh, yeah, is steel pipe... Is it that... Oh, steel beams are made of like four steel, right? And then steel pipes are made of like one. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's the same ratio as a lot of the, of, of the recipes where it's basically a, a third cheaper than normal. I think they're all roughly that. Except the quick, that one, then. the quick wire one, because that's a d different kettle of fish. Okay, next hard drive going Data in. Data on the hard drive has been salvaged and can be repurposed to unlock an alternate recipe. Uh, I will do the research will provide and skip what Ada's saying. Recipes. Wait, no, I can't. Stop. Okay. Do, do. Okay, so those have been researched. Also, I can research yellow shards right now. Yay! Don't look at the shards. <laughs> there we 
go. That's all done. We have uh, literally no milestones to work on right now. Oh, I've got 19 containment cards. Except, for me. Um, we're we're actually oh. probably at the point. I've just realised. You no, know, last episode when I said, "Oh, I don't have the Caterham on me." To oh, are you thing. serious? I had 19 ingots apparently. You twit. <laughs> uh, yeah. God damn it. That's funny. Why is there concrete in this box? Did I put this in here? I feel like it was you. Probably you. Wow. That assumption right there. Mm-hmm. I feel hurt, quite frankly. Hurt and a little bit attacked. <laughs> no evidence for this. <laughs> You're not like, I didn't do it. You're like, there's no evidence. <laughs> Collusion! Oh dear. Our storage is a real, real mess. Doesn't help that I can't me. sort. Hey, I can restock on uh, on rebar. Nice. I could dump these ingots in there. Try and keep this to actual important stuff that should be in here, rather it than feels random like this junk. Isn't flowing fast enough. I'm gonna go check on the steel production. Oh, like the, the steel's looking too intermittent. Well, maybe I'll just hook the stuff up while I'm there. Don't need the wood and the leaves. Probably shouldn't chuck them in there either, but I've done it now. We actually have quite a lot of quartz. Oh, you know what? We shouldn't have actually... We should have probably mainlined the other researches instead of going for the hard drives because if I pick up this quartz out of the, the box, then the game's like, oh, you've got quartz, and then we'll let me pick the raw quartz research. So we'll do that in seven minutes. And then the other one is sulfur. I don't think we actually have any. Huh. So, we'll need to direct pipes to here. I'll need 18 pipes, and I've got one, two, three, four of these, which means we'll need 72 pipes. I've still got some iron ingots on me, damn it. Currently, pipes are... I think we have a full belt. Do you remember what the rate of pipes was? Nope. That is your <laughs> job, and I have mostly just ignored that all those problems. The hell? I just teleported quite away. 60 pipes, okay. I'll go check on the, the big storage, which is now pink. And? We voted for this, viewers. This is your fault. Exactly, see? You agreed to it. Democracy, Bentham. <laughs> what do you think? We should have another vote to cancel the last vote? <laughs> oh, don't. Don't start. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, oh, is this... Does this storage do anything? Uh, oh, no, it doesn't. Okay. However, I... downstairs we'd need twice the amount of... Concrete. Ugh. I'm thinking it is time to, to do some overhauling of these belts because I can at the same time show off the fancy new stuff that is... Fancy new stuff? Say it ain't so! Indeed, the, there is fancy new stuff and it is um, vertical conveyors and I want to use them to make the screws not horrifying. Say it ain't so, turn the lights off, carry me home. These make 90 per minute each, so we've got 360 per minute being made, which actually is too much for a single belt. I was hoping to narrow it down to a single belt, but I wonder if we can research conveyor belts mark for... Oh no, we can't, we have no research we can do. Oh yeah, it's probably about time we unlock the next um, space elevator stage. Four. Maybe. Shall I go see One, if we can do that? Three, four. 
sure. Uh, I need 36. Miles That's an annoying number. Concluded. Fix it, freighter re-entry complete. Okay, um, go do the hard drive thing, but then don't put another hard drive in yet. All right, I'm coming back. All right, modular frames. Uh, oh, I think we have just enough modular frames to complete the, uh, the space elevator. So it will use up our supply of modular frames, but what else are we doing with them? We And the building stuff with them? Oh, the hard drive's like, what, three minutes, 40 from being done? Oh, that was the research thing coming back. The, the milestone thing, even. God damn it, Bentham! There was a, a notification! I, I didn't. over here. I don't pay attention to what it actually says. I'm just like, Ada said a thing. That probably means Next it's time, time to redo Next time you want me to do something, I'll think you're crying wolf and it won't get done. You know how this works. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. Something got done. Well, well in a minute and a half, you can, you can come back and do it then. We'll see if I actually come back in a minute and a half then, won't we? <laughs> If you want a client to try and handle working out hard drive research. Oh, God. Uh, right. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to redirect some of you. You need 30 per minute and you need 15 per minute. Do we have a way to double the speed of the, uh, the constructors? Um... You could use the power shards to do it, but it's a big power sink. It's an option yeah. if you need to. Right, I, we're ready to get um, the next space elevator stage. Should we to launch it? Um, no, I want to be there. Well, I know you want to. You're gonna want to have a nice view. Yeah. Okay, I'll be in there in a second. I'm just trying to do quickly calculations things. Uh, right. So, yeah, we'll double your output. And that'll make it 36. And we'll double your output as well. That'll make it well more than 36, because that makes 72. Remember, you're not doubling output, you're doubling just the speed in the machine. It will it will need twice the input, too. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's why I'm actually doing it, because I've got twice too much input. Okay. My input is too high. So I'm going to just double the output. And then I've got one machine working at 36. 36 actually probably is enough. Why don't you just build more machines? Are you in a confined space? I'll tell the it's 30 and I need 36. Uh, confined space. Oh, uh... This truck... No, it, no, it's working fine. This is weird. All of the nodes for the truck have become pause nodes. That's but the odd. truck is treating them like normal driving nodes. That might just be a client side thing. I feel like for your side it looks normal, but for me... I think it looks normal on my side. For me, the path seems to suggest that the truck starts and stops, waits three seconds, starts, stops, waits three seconds, like, 50 times between here and the other side of its... its route. But it seems to be doing it fine, so, yeah. Oh, there's poison flowers here. I'm on my way to the space elevator. Just everywhere. Ready? Oh, I've, I've wandered off because I, I thought you were busy. Hang on, I'm on my way I back. I should be there in a second. You were doing some number stuff. I said I was being there in a second. Yeah, but it wasn't a second, was it? It was a minute. Sure, I said I'd be there in a minute. It's been a minute. <laughs> Hello. Do you want to get, like, a wide angle of it? Oh, yeah. That's the thing. You can't do this in, in single player. Tell me when. Right. Let me find a good, like, wide-angle shot. We'll find it if I can actually do this. Actually, I'll try sealing it to check that that's a thing that can be done. Yep. Sealing it. I'm trying to find a place in our base that I can get a shot from, but I'm kind of covered in factory at the moment. Ready to send. We, we, Aha, we've got some, we got some watchtowers and stuff, like... Uh, yeah, I'm going to go to one of the watchtowers. Yeah. Uh... Uh... You ready? Okay. Three, two, 
I don't. I fell off the watchtower. <laughs> Tell me when you're back up there. Three, two, one, go. Kachunk. Off it goes. Whee. Bye. Honestly, I thought it'd be more impressive. Well, the cool thing is, like, the arms doing all their gubbins, and then, yeah. And also, the cool thing is, we unlocked a bunch more research. Oil and industrial manufacturing. <gasps> yeah, we can get this stuff right now. Yes, truck. Truck. truck so truck, I'm, I'm truck. gonna, just so you don't get too overexcited, uh, we require a bunch of awkward gubbins to make the truck. And the compute. What's the computer do? I think we require oil to get the truck, so we're gonna have to sort that out. What does the computer do, though? Uh, that's a uh, late stage um, component. It's it's modular frames, three electric boogaloo. Oh, it's just component. Okay. Yeah. Jetpack. And yeah, we're not mask. quite up, up to, to tier uh, six because tier six requires uh, heavy modular frames and computers. Eh. Eh. But we can dream. I have a dream. We can absolutely do oil processing. Right, where was I? I was going to redo that. So yeah, after that sidetrack where we've now got more stuff, I'm going to get back to actually working on the belt system over here. Annoyingly, I found out I can't condense the screw supply down to one belt, but I can condense it down to two, so I might do that. But then is it worth the hassle? Maybe? Right. No, it's not actually, It's not worth the hassle. I'll just have to keep it like that. How do I make the things that make the thing faster? Try saying that again, but have it make sense. <laughs> How do I make the things that make the thing faster? That's You just said the same thing again there. I need a green power slug. Okay. And then you need I to need get a yellow one to make the next tier up? You need to get a power shard. Which I make from power a slug. power shard will give you an extra 50% capacity for the, the Which machine. Which you make from a slug. Yes. Okay. Oh yeah, did you did you queue up another... Oh, the hard drive will be ready by now. For reals this time. Uh, really? Really? Will it? <laughs> will it? Just get over here. We need to Wait, research does it speed sulfur. Up the machine? Does it speed up the input as well? Yes. Okay, good. Right. Okay, just double checking that. I know the, you said it earlier. It, I was like, just yeah, double checking. It's the whole machine will run 50% faster. It will need 50% more stuff. It will produce 50% more stuff. Yeah. Well, I need to come back to get the slugs anyway, so. Yeah. Also, I think some of the slugs will need researching. We might not have the ability to use any of them except the uh, yellow slug. Also, I went to the machine because I wasn't thinking, so I can now see the researches. Modular frame, stator, and reinforced iron plate. No! Have a look at them. I'm inclined to say stator because I'm interested by the idea of using quickwire for it and um, recent experimentation with quickwire has told me we get tons. Done. Now. Slugs. I need those slugs. Okay, but before you go, please uh, grab the sulfur, I think it is, or the gunpowder. One of the things. Sulf uh, quartz, is it? Yeah, the quartz. Grab the quartz in there and put that in the research thing. I guess I probably could have done that myself, but I don't know. But I need to research my slugs. You, we've got and we've got there's power shards in there already. Just wait, where are the power shards? You're the worst. Have you taken the quartz? Wait, where are the power shards? They're in the main box. Oh right. I need a tier two power shard though. No, there's not. There's no such thing. There is only power oh. shards. Really? Okay, that's weird. Right, grabbing them. Thank you. Put Where is the quartz? Got it. I've already put some in the man, but put the rest in because it needs 25. <laughs> 15 okay. minutes? Yep, once that's done, will it be able to go get quartz? We actually need to find some just gunpowder in the wild in order to research that so that we can uh, 
We can Gun scan for it. Gunpowder in the wild. Yeah. Yes, because gunpowder is a naturally occurring substance. It is in this a game. Nice. Actually, no, I think it's sulfur, but yeah. Okay, sulfur we need to find in the wild. Okay, that's easier. Right, now I'm going to take a look at this nightmare and see if I can make it less of a nightmare. I'm going to go out on a limb. Wait a minute, these say... screws aren't even doing anything anymore. Yeah, we aren't. We did rods. So these bills don't need to be here at all? Quite possibly, no. You sure you got the, the the whole rod supply you need? No, I'm pretty sure that at some point you were like, I can't give you that, so I'm giving you this instead. And I was like, will you remember, Bentham? And you said, oh, of course I will remember. Let's take a look at this. Oh, it's ingots. We're, we're turning ingots into, into... into the screws now. So this whole thing is ingot-based. Consumption rate is... 120 per minute. I reckon. Probably. Okay, 120 per minute. Are we producing that much? Huh? That is this belt here. This is the one coming from offsite. Wait, I just dropped my six power shards in and it turned it into one power shard. What? Do you have five in your inventory still? No. Try taking them out? You may have just deleted five of our shards. You put one I in. I, I think I deleted... I, I just dropped the entire stack because I assumed that it would overflow. Okay. Uh, yep, nope, they're gone. That's it. Uh, Bentham, we need to research power shards. There's probably some green slugs still around. I think I dumped at least one in, in the, uh, the thing. So, four of these... Yeah, this is producing 120, so the bottom floor of your factory is fully supplied on screws. How do I leave this? Am I trapped in here now? Did I not make a door? There is a door. Don't break my factory. This isn't... this is my factory. You don't even know what I'm talking about. You said a minute ago, I'm trapped in your factory now. I'm over at somewhere else now, where I didn't you put a door. You just said that like 10 seconds ago. You said, I'm trapped in your factory now. And I said, please don't break my factory. Because I, did not, I did not say your factory. Okay, okay. Everyone go back, listen to what he said, then comment, and remind him I'm right. Thank you. You said my factory. I don't think I did, because it, I did. know it's not your factory, it's mine, I built it. Right, power shards! So this level is all good, the iron plates actually might not be great. The... Oh, the belt's got huge gaps on it, that seems completely not good. What's the requirements of this? This is 20 per minute, so this is requiring uh, 120 iron plates per minute. Ah, yeah, I don't think we're providing that. Damn it, Bentham. This? I, this is, I think this is yours. Yeah, and you're providing the inputs, and I said, Bentham, I need this and this, and you probably said at one point, yeah, I'll do this later. Yeah. You're the worst. <laughs> Ah, it is 120, but it gets split between two different things. Uh, and one of them is... Oh, the storage. Right. So it was 120, but then some of the storage got emptied because it needed to be emptied. Um, how's the storage looking? Because what I might do is keep it like that, but make it so like only a third goes to storage so that it has less of an impact on... Oh, yeah, this is full. Like, what? It's literally building up as I watch, huh? 
Okay. Actually, that wait a work. minute. This is only like 60 per second to start with, though. Mm-hmm. That's the reason all my stuff's been running so slowly. Yeah, because it's running off your stuff. I gave you the thing, and you said, I will fix this. I remember. There's only so much I can do at once. Cleaning up your messes. Wow. <laughs> right, I'm pretty sure I can just delete these screw lines. And I can then use that to make more plates to provide the plates. But I will check the higher floors because... Is the limestone running slowly? It no. might be. We haven't worked on it in a long time. Yeah, the limestone is definitely running behind schedule. Right, what is this yeah. floor about? Uh, I see rods moving about. Where are these coming from? Fields of rods. Screw belts too. There should be 60 per minute ingots coming in here. As for rods, oh god, I think it's it's 60 per minute. Yeah, okay. And then this splitter nightmare leading up to here. Oh, this is literally just the rotors and stages. I don't have to worry about this. Ah! And I think to myself, what a wonderful world. And up on the top floor, uh, oh, is this all wires? Ah, oh, yeah, this is my department. Wires and steel pipes. So, I need 60 per minute rods coming through here, which looks like it's fine. I also need 60 per minute ingots coming through there, and that looks like 30 per minute to me. Ow. Yep, that is 30 per minute, okay. Right, all of these screw belts can just go, turns out. I was trying to make them more efficient before, and I'm like, oh, nope, they're just not needed. It's not even a thing. Mm-hmm. Right, I need to go up to the top floor. Right, up here. We're gonna need to have words, so... I'm just gonna get rid of this. It leaves that belt slightly floating, but it's... it's there's just too much going oh. on in this area. Bentham! You're leaving a floating belt? Yeah, I know. What has the world come to? Because it's, it's on top of a blooming 12 high stack of stackable conveyors. I... I feel so ashamed. You don't. <laughs> you were meant to be the chosen one! Here's a cool thing. Thanks to vertical conveyor belts, I can get rid of the horrible nightmare mess coming out the front of your wire factory, finally. Uh, I kinda liked it. It was, it was terrible. That's why I liked it. Yep, that's why I'm deleting it. Oh, we're gonna have so much room out front of our uh, our factory now that I'm clearing away all this screw stuff. And I think to myself. I just, just want to check something. Right, if we're adding... Okay, so this is an important important thing for, for viewers. I feel like I probably addressed this already on my single player series by now, but people keep telling me that the alternate screw recipe is more efficient in terms of resources than the basic screw recipe, and the wrong. Because what, it's, viewers being wrong, Bentham? Because it's two iron ingots, makes 12 screws, which is the same as one iron ingot makes six screws, and also one iron ingot makes one rod. So it is the same. You don't save any materials using the alternate recipe, all you do is save power and space. Bentham. How mm -hmm. dare you. 
I had to physically show people because I explained it in a video and everyone was like, no, you're wrong. I'm imagining you physically showing people, like, dragging people over to the computer and being like, look at it. That's what you got to do. So I've got too much crap on me. What is this all? It's all the bloody screws from deleting all those belts. Oh, there's actually space in the screw storage. I guess this isn't being loaded anymore. Oh, yeah, I, I did disconnected it, didn't I? You, you, you did a lot of things. A long, long time ago. In a galaxy far, far away. Right, let's use a conveyor lift. How do these work? Bring on the bad boys. They're annoying. Travel, travel. Travel. God damn it, fill up my inventory again, really? We need more space. I'm just dumping ingots in, in a chest and I realize that's heresy and everyone's gonna hate me for it. Yeah, you were complaining about that whole chest thing earlier and now you're doing it yourself? I'm complaining that it's over full. But mm -hmm. also, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we just need there to be a merger out front of these. Oh no! Okay, they didn't fall down. We're good. Hey, I should set my hotbar properly. And there's the conveyor lifts, by the way, for people who want to see them. I'm literally the using them over here right now. Oh, nice. Damn, you beat me to it. Also, we've got industrial storage containers now. Their name clips off the bottom of the box because they just changed it, and it's the longest name of anything in the game now, I think. What? The what? 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 Oh, no, it isn't actually. They've just done the formatting, dumb. The industrial storage container in the in the build menu, the word container clips off the bottom of the thing. Oh. This is experimental branch, so... Yeah, that's the least of your issues in, in something like this. Okay, anyway, merger. Okay, also, why the, can you not connect? The bounding boxes of mergers and splitters are much smaller now. Oh, did that not build, or what happened there? You know, I found a, f a little issue. B build the... Build. When connecting from a wall to a, uh, a conveyor, it doesn't work. I've got weird glitches happening over here. I think I've got a splitter in this... Smelter, so if you're around, it'd be nice if you could come. Yeah, there's an invisible splitter, god damn it. Yeah, so well, the, the vertical conveyors are very fiddly to use right now. Once you get them in place, they will work fine. Where about are you? Uh, I'm in the, the I'm steel factory. I'm gonna come over and see how it's going. Because I can't, I can't fix my issue until you're available. I see your name clipping through the wall. Hello. There it is. Yeah, so getting... Like, just building vertical conveyors can be a bit of a challenge. You've got to build from the bottom. You, you can't... Actually, no, you can build from the top, but it's got to be from just I, it, the it, end of a belt. Built, built already, right? Yeah. You're but, trying to connect it and it's just throwing a fit? Yeah. Um, then you will probably have built the vertical conveyor backwards. Well, I built it from bottom up. Am I not meant to build from the bottom up? I don't know. Oh, uh-oh. Did that bork it? Is it borked? Well, now I'm trying to And there goes it. the game. If the game's crashed, mate. <laughs> No, the game's crashed for you. Oh, okay. Um, well, that's probably the end of the episode then, right? <laughs> well, I think we've got to at least finish this before we go. But I'm not there anymore! Log in!
I've got to send my crash report. Log in! I'm trying. It's going to take five minutes. Oh, God, your internet is just the worst. i got to send a crash report and stuff. Sorry, I didn't know that sending a crash report was equivalent of, like, going out to the shops. <laughs> So how come the, the vertical conveyor was just freestanding? It looked, or at least it looked like it to me. You'd what never do you mean connected. Freestanding? Did you have it connected to a belt? No. Do I need to? You should build it off of a belt. I think. I didn't know you could do it any other way. I built it off of a stackable conveyor pole. I don't know you could do that either. Well, I, you can. Joining game. That's a so it says that the playtime of this save is 30 minutes. Yeah, because I made a new save. Oh, okay. No, but it should still record the... Um, it should uh, still record yeah, the time. It's, um, it's not working. I'll have a look at it, if I can get back in. Fix it tip number 19. Faster belts don't necessarily mean faster production. It crashed again. Try now? What do you mean now? I've stopped trying to play stuff. I can't just try now. It crashed again, E. Yeah, so load up and try again. Keeping all of this in. <laughs> this is how you with. troubleshoot. Joining game. Fix it. Tip number one. Don't die. I'm not in yet. Don't. <laughs> Manglepok has joined the game. Hold on. It's not. It's been weird. Hold on now. Uh, uh. It's acting as if I've picked up the rebar gun for the first time. For the very first time. He's gonna do that for everything? No, okay. Hey, can you see me? Bye. Okay, I seem to be functioning. Right. Okay. What do you. What are you trying Come to do? Here. I can't because this ladder is blocked by this belt. Let's see. No, this side. don't go up the ladder. Go up the stairs we put in. I can't see. I'm in a box right now. There's a door in front of you. Go out the door. I didn't see that. Also, there's random junk on the, you on the ground build over this here. Place. There's, a, there's a crate here. Why did you do this? I've been deconstructing things. We're mid renovation. Oh, God. Where are you? Okay. Up here. I can't get to you there. You can. You just jump over things. How do you think I got here? Fight my way through belt hell. I never wanted yeah. to see this again. I can't. I can't reach you. You can. I got oh, here. Jesus. Okay. Uh, there we go. I'm Hi. here now. Right. Huh. Okay. What are you trying to do? So I, I put. I put a bit of uh, belt there, and I'm like, right. What if we do? The conveyor lift downwards. I've crashed again. Nah. It turns out that just getting the conveyor lift out is what triggers you to crash. Can we end the episode now? <laughs> we have to end the episode. Conveyor lifts are broken in multiplayer. They cause people to crash. Okay. Thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you have, like, subscribe. But until next time, Manga Pokers left the game. Stay shiny. Goodbye.